a bit weird to just excuse that my hair is extremely greasy it's being washed tomorrow morning very matted it's getting sorted don't worry about it um he wants to know the kind of things i'd like and the things inspiration he'd like for my stocking and christmas eve box because that time is fast approaching and we won't have another chance to go into town um so i think he wants to get it done um, and we will separate off so he'll get bits for me i'll get bits for him however i have found a load of stuff on amazon so if you need a quick fix if you've got amazon prime which i totally recommend or if you don't get it just for christmas um gifts for men or gifts gadgets wise oh my god amazon i have got some brilliant ones because i've been really stuck because i'm booking stuff for next year that'll be part of my christmas present for him so he's got things that he won't be able to wrap like unwrap obviously but i obviously want to make sure i get him some nice bits and pieces for christmas day and things that i know he's actually going to enjoy so i found quite a few things that you know and considering it's black friday as well there's just it's just ridiculous like all this stuff i'm looking at it going like that's cool a beer bottle opener is it gonna focus probably not oh there we go so it is now saturday jacqueline hill on i'm getting through my watch later um on youtube i've got my fluffy socks when i come out of the shower because can i just say it is so cold um and these are festive and um, they're from primark of course and i'm gonna get some more and ask for more from matt for like a christmas eve but i'm gonna jump in the shower but i'm also gonna do a little bit of skincare before i sort this out so i'm gonna be using a little silicone exfoliating thing that i've also had got from primark the water remover uh, makeup remover puff um and i'm also going to use my w7 peachy clean cleanser it's because i don't have any makeup on obviously but where i've had so many like trouble areas i want to try and like cleanse my skin before i put makeup on for today i've got a light in our kitchen replaced and it is super bright but i just wanted to show you i'm gonna have some cocoa pops of course i think this is just a mandatory breakfast in my life right now and this container is from cherries and can i just say it's huge um i take cocoa pops with me every morning to work mum decanted some apple juice for me because she loves me and we're gonna have it in a mug we're gonna have it in my cute little mug which is actually now my fruit juice mug mum refused to let me use anything but fruit juice in it uh tea but she's agreed to let me use fruit juice because she bought this for me to have tea which i will be having just not in that mug um apple juice in a lock and lock gotta be gotta be and then some milk so, yeah. so i'm already i feel like my on camera my skin's looking very i don't know but i actually really like my makeup off camera so i'm wearing my miss selfish jumper which i absolutely love this jumper has been a firm favorite of mine for a very very long time um i've got a boho moon boohoo moon boho moon i think ring on i've got this bracelet on which courtney gifted me in a christmas swap last year which is really cute um so yeah i'm really i just i absolutely love this bracelet and i thought you know what's crack out time to crack out a bit more jewelry festive season is coming um two of my nails are hanging on by a thread but i managed to sort out my nail appointment so i'm getting that done on saturday before i go to this etsy I go to the etsy kind of fair with dawn who's my colleague um and you'll meet her um but yeah so i'm feeling a lot better i've been really really poorly i've had that really like viral cold that's been going around at the moment not covid i was testing all the time completely covid free however obviously this cold completely not not me for six it was absolutely horrendous um but i feel a lot better now my favorite garden center was lacking in the christmas decorations and christmas spirit when we when they went on wednesday so hopefully it's perked up a bit main reason we're going is so grandma can get her wreath so i'll film that for you guys because i filmed it last year We'll, I'll probably get a hot chocolate, I feel really festive, try and get mum, persuade mum to um, get some pictures of me because, you know, she loves me and Instagram could really do with a bit of a festive post. Organise my room when I come back, but how beautiful. I've got, so, oh, it's just lovely. I've got an umbrella in there just in case. Because I just thought for the pictures I want mum to try and get of me, it in the side just wouldn't look nice. Um, but yeah, I just think it's such a nice rucksack. I just want to say to anyone who has these numbers, I block them and they come back. How do you get rid of them? I don't know whether my number's been leaked. Maybe I need to change my number. I'm going to try out these new shoes as well for Pretty Little Thing. I haven't opened them yet. And I'm going to put a strapless bra on because the pictures I want mum to give me, I want to be cute without a bra strap. I got this secret push-up bra because I've always wanted to try one. Um, so we'll give that a go. Probably New Year's <laughs> will be the 
test of that. But these are the shoes, and can I just say, I'm so into Monster Compers, as you couldn't tell. But these are like a dupe, I swear, for like a Nike or Adidas, I'm not too sure. I can confirm, these are very comfy. Mum had to help me with the laces. But yeah, they're so nice. Definitely, especially the more cold. Yes. It's definitely the more colder season, because I am absolutely frozen. Oh, oh it's very cold. Um, but I'm with Grandma and Mum. So yeah, you are excited? Yeah, that is how very enthusiastic, Mum. Oh, look. Hello. Oh, look how nice. Oh, I love them. That's really cute. I like that one. Yes, I saw that straight away. Actually, they're both. I don't know. So, thank you, Grandma. You're welcome. They've got coffees and toasted tea cakes. Nice to see you. Isn't it? I know, ditto. <laughs> I know. It's definitely a Christmas thing that we have to do every year. We can't have Christmas until we've been here. I've got a sausage bat, hot chocolate, which Mum's just had to be a David Bailey again, haven't you? <laughs> That's not I prefer go and get a trolley. Yeah, probably a good idea. Yeah. For Opal, oh, this would be so cute. Penguins as well. Oh my goodness. I'm gonna have to get that. Do they do? All oh, they do. Okay. Yeah. I'm gonna have to get that because obviously it is her first Christmas. Oh my gosh, so cute. I prefer the white ones personally. Yeah, it's fine if I'm going to put them to sit though. Oh yeah, does that one not, oh, does that sand then? That yeah, but they've got white ones that sand. I think things like this are really, really cute. Or is that just me? Mum's favourite section. We've picked up some more bits. I've got a gift for family in there. We have some great gifting here. And scents. In the car now. We've got quite a few paper bags here. But look, we've got my bag. I'm scoff. But yeah, got some beautiful things. I'm really, really happy with this stuff I got, and I will show you guys. I got some gifts, two gifts, technically three gifts. So, Beth, if you're watching this, you're going to see something I got for Opal <coughs> because I just couldn't resist. <laughs> Thank you very much. All right, Grandma has done what Grandma does every year and has treated me to an advent calendar. So I will be sharing some chocolates with my mum because I've now got five advent calendars, which to me is a bit excessive. However, you know, it's Christmas and hopefully this year we can have the Christmas that we all deserve. So yeah, thank you very much. That's all right, I appreciate it. I always get a limp one. We're home, we have the best time at the garden centre and tomorrow's going to be just as good um, but with friends instead. I believe Josh will be in the video as well so that'll be fun for you guys to meet him um, and obviously Matt, Alex, not yet. I'm biding my time with her, you know. Um, so yeah, um, so that'll be fun. I cannot wait to go. But I bought some really cute bits which I'm going to show you guys um, but I'm just going to get myself settled. I need a wee. 
Um, and my pretty little thing parcel came. I thought I got it delivered to my grandma's, but Hermes decided to leave it on a really hot radiator, so the plastic has nearly melted. So I've turned my lamp on because it is very dark. I want cosy vibes. I would light a candle, but I need to show you guys what I got first. You know what I'm like. It is... 10 past 3, I'm going to wait for my video to go up at 4 so then I'm going to film some content before Mac comes and gets me because we're going to Mackey's. I've got my iPad, I've got Pringles, I've got my drink. I'm going to watch Grey's Anatomy and then I'm going to film the haul for you guys and show you what I got and then I'm going to film a Poundland haul and slash gift guide kind of video um, and then, yeah. I don't really know what I'm going to do for Christmas backdrop this year because I film in front of my bed now, which is just nice because I like I like filming in front of this. But I'm not really sure what backdrops to do for Christmas because I like having something. So I may get some Christmas, like a Christmas cushion or so. I filmed my two videos and I'm really happy, but I've got to quickly show you guys what's in this bag of happiness um, and Christmas and festivities and I'm just so excited. I feel so much more festive now. I knew going to this garden centre would make me feel so much better. Um, but obviously, my anxiety did flare up a little bit when we were there, but I still enjoyed myself nonetheless. And I'm going to show you everything I got. So, the total came to about £68, I think, just to give you a bit, guys, of a bit of context. So, I got a couple of gifts because their gifting was really good, as I showed you. Um, Bayless and Harding. So, I got this um, Pampa set, Peach Peony and Jasmine. It smells amazing, by the way. Um, you've got hand soak crystals, you've got a hand cream and a nail file. Perfect either stocking filler or gift for anyone that loves this kind of thing. I know exactly who this is going for. And this was £8, which I think for the items you get in here is very reasonably priced. Then also from Bayless and Harding I got this, which can I just say is presented in the most beautiful way. Um, it's two luxury hand soaps, which for the person that's receiving this, she will absolutely love this because it's a practical gift, but it's beautiful. And it smells amazing. And I just think the little stand it's on as well that it comes with. Very, very nice. Um, I got some Christmas cards from, and these are by Noel Tat. And they are, uh, they were 4 99 so basically a fiver. And you get 12 in here. And they're of this design. I thought these were the most festive I could find. Um, I love the Robins, the snow scene. Classic London letterbox. Is that London letterbox? Early this year. So I'm not sure whether I'm going to be wrapping the majority of my Christmas presents this year or whether I'm going to ask other people to help me. However, I thought I'd buy this and this is by Premier and this was at £4. It is 2.7 metres and it's a natural deer ribbon. And I just thought it was really cute. They had so many different designs, so many different ones. But I thought this one was the best. So we'll see how I make that look. Um, they have 50% off their candles. Now, if you remember correctly, I gave away a load of my candles. However... I'm at home a lot more now. I'm going to be at home most weekdays. So I thought, you know what? I'm going to get myself two candles. 50% off. Bargain. Um, I got the mauled wine candle because the packaging has got a bit funny. And it's a bit misshapen. And the wick was in the wrong place. But I don't care because I got it for so much cheaper than it retails for. Um, and it smells amazing. Cla I don't like mauled wine. Oh, I'm pretty sure I don't because the last time I tried it, it was rank. Um, but the smell of this candle. Beautiful. Um, and then I also got the Christmas trees, Forest of Fur, um, and I think it's the same thing, the packaging was a bit, mm, like, discolor, like, discolor, discoloration in it, but, oh, it smells amazing, I don't know why I'm showing you it, it's a bog sounded candle, but it smells amazing, this one was £10, the Maud Wine one retails for 9 so I've got this for £5, got the other candle for £4, it's a baby's first Christmas, and it's really, really cute, I just, it was a display wrapped in bubble wrap, which was great, um, so I've got two tea light holders. I want to get unscented tea lights because I think I got rid of mine. I'll keep that receipt because I've got my loyalty points. I boosted my points, I tell you. Um, so this was three pound fifty. So some designs were more expensive than. Hello. 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 You're right. Yeah, I'm Okay, I'm just quickly finishing filming this last bit, and then I'll be down. Okay. Alright, I love you. Love you too. Hey. Um, so more some designs were more expensive than others. I'll show you guys some of my mum's chosen ones. But how pretty. This is the kind of theme I want to go for. So I've got that one. And then I also got a bigger one. Oh, I'll just show you. Let's just spread this Christmas cheer, okay? Because this time of year, 
is the best. But I will be keeping this bubble wrap because, what's it called? Because, you know, anything to help store. I don't know, I just got this big one. Um, and this big one was eight pounds, whereas some were like 18. I think it was literally just for the design, but I'm not actually sure. So, you know, my favorite, one of my favorite garden centers, which I went to today, is the best quality, so I don't mind. Um, and then I got this light up star, which I don't have to keep the, there we go. And it was gorgeous. I just couldn't resist. 10 pounds for this, but it lights up. Let me turn off the light a minute. Do you get what I mean? How bloody beautiful. Made it to Mackey's and can I just say, Christmas is here guys. Because it's on the blooming boards. Still too early. No, it's not. It is. We're going Christmas shopping tomorrow. You are. Um there <laughs> so i am home from babysitting now i've got myself a little drink um in my really cute mug um my mm. makeup's lasted really well can i just add it's just come off like my kind of blemish areas but my eyeshadow my eyeliner and my skin makeup like i don't know how we see like it's a bit textured it's not actually bad i lost a nail trying to get into my maltesers tonight i am low-key kind of gutted but I've kept it. I've actually got it here. <laughs> so gross. Um, I'm going to try and use some nail glue to stick it back on just to film some videos. So I can still get some more festive content film because I did so much editing. I've got my giveaway up on private. My week kind of vlog thing on private ready. So it is now Sunday. It is so cold. Well, it's not cold in the flat because I've got the heat on. But my room, obviously, I turned my heating off my radiator because I'm not going to have my heating on when I'm opening my window a little bit because I like air coming into my room um but yeah so my room was absolutely freezing so I've got my cozy polar bear kind of socks on from Primark my Primark Donald Duck joggers which I've been living in I kid you not um my snuggly and also my Primark pajama tops I'm pretty much all in Primark except for this um I've got my yogurt for breakfast it's half past 10 waiting to see if matt's alive because if he's not i'm gonna have to go to town on my own which i'm gonna be low-key annoyed about but hopefully he'll be he'll be here by 12 um because uh missions i need to go to poundland i need to go super drug boots primark and card factory i'm all ready to go i am nicely wrapped up warm i've got sunglasses because it's actually very bright and sunny today and we're obviously now is getting into more winter weather and the winter time and autumnal time of year the sun is very low so you know why not wear a pair of sunnies if you can you know um so i'm just looking out for matt i don't actually know when he's getting here he did leave not that long ago so i'm impressed um i'm gonna turn everything off i haven't made my bed but i put away all my makeup though and i'm gonna be taking out my christmas mug so like how cute Lots of stuff, babe. Picked up my brow pencil because it's twenty percent off. Are you loving? You loving this? Yeah. So much fun, isn't it? Mm. Having to move because we've just come across the Harry Potter section. I picked up some bits for my bestie for her box, but I'm going to leave you now. Okay, have fun. I need to find another three for two. Can you, before you do that, can you help me find another? Because I don't think there's any more Snow White things. You grab that one and give it to me. I'm not sure who it's for yet, but uh... <laughs> Do you think I'm Cinderella? Yeah. Why, Jesus? Because I clean up after you all the time. Yeah, you're my Cinderella. Yeah, because I clear up after you all the time. It is. <laughs> yes, it is. <laughs> Right, we're back in the car. Was it successful? Yeah, my face is freezing. <laughs> my bank account is hating me right now, but I've got some painkillers for my head because Matt's killing me that I haven't had anything. Got a sausage roll from Greg's and got a baguette. Um, but yeah, there's going to be a gift guide for him um, that I'm going to be doing later because I got quite a lot of... Well, Matt's all done now. Um, so yeah. 
well maybe i'm gonna see how much i've got him and like put it in like the stocking and sack and christmas eve box and stuff because obviously you've got sweets coming I might get him some more sweet treats or whatever he knows about this you know just like little bits but yeah my besties all bought for i bought a lot i bought a lot i'm actually quite warm because of my scarf so matt is nice and snug are you happy yeah the next the garden center <laughs> <laughs> that didn't take long, did it? That was hard. How much are they? Twelve ninety nine. Feel the weight on that. <laughs> Pretty. Well, I found them already. So, <gasps> babe, there's stockings with gonks on. <gasps> oh my god! Look at that. And there's my. <gasps> god, Matt, the polar bear moves. I'm glad you do. I'm guessing that's a no from you. Yeah, that's a massive no. Oh, no cute pyjamas. I'm actually good at that. They're cute. They're on my Acrylic baby penguins. Mm. Stuck in an iceberg. If I knew what I had to get you for Christmas was a trolley, that would have saved me a lot of money. Oh, look. Libby. Oh, it says Libby. I know it says Libby. Oh, I thought, I thought it was going to say that it says Lily, then I was thinking right. They never have my name. No, look. It's the mother load of all. Oh my god. Five. Five. <laughs> 40 rounds. I want one. You get it for me, right? <laughs> the tree, though. The tree is just the tree of dreams. <laughs> well, no, that's just not factually correct, is it? It's, um, but that's cute, though. Yeah, it's not far off. Oh, look at the. <gasps> Babe, this is a 1999 one. It's a packet. <gasps> Babe, there's gonk cereal bowls. Gonk cereal bowls. Is there a gonk cup? I got one last year, so it feels like it should be tradition. How cute is that? I could so see me having my cocoa pops in that. Look at that. Children's little garden set. And there's a little light up gonk. Seven ninety nine. That's a bit more like it. <laughs> I think you're a bit shocked by golden gone centre prices, aren't you? Oh, look at the gonks up there. Oh, can you carry my bowl for me so I don't drop it? So I was I'm going to drop it. No, don't do that. <gasps> look at the gonks. You cannot look at me and tell me that that is not you. I'm sorry. I just call you a liar, to be honest. Oh, baby, it's a little advent mat. Ah. This is an advent one. Oh god, I just hit something. And you could put little sweets in it for me. For advent. I've, I've three days to do that. <laughs> nah. Put a jelly tot on each one. <laughs> That's cute. Says I've got jelly tots. You can buy jelly tots. 22. <gasps> you can keep that. So, Christmas lights. Yes. Oh, oh they're the ones that are very nice. Thank you, Alex, for pointing out the. That's when he thinks they're those ones, and then actually they've switched them out inside, and then he sets them up, and it's actually. Either that one or that one. Matt, Matt, that Santa stop here sign, which is sick, is cheaper than that cushion. <laughs> We're outside and try to use a business card for your dad, and get that for outside the house. 110 quid. <laughs> These, though, they're really nice. What's that? That's just the adapter. That's not a Christmas decoration. Lantern. They're nice. Which one did you want? I can get you that one. Oh, can lantern you? One. You actually? Yeah. No, you're not. I can get you a lantern one. How much are they though? Because if there is been. Look, oh, that's cute. That one plays music. No. That's cute. Are they more expensive? Take your pick. No. Mm. Pick. Alex, I need your help. The initiative set that Alex actually pointed out to me. They put a tea light in the back. Just, oh, I love Christmas. However, Matt and Josh have found loads of mistletoe that they're definitely going to be. Just found the pampas grass. Pampas grass, pampas grass, whatever it's called. That is a horse's tail. Oh my goodness. How much is that? 13 pounds, but I really want it. Alex, have you seen this? Let me try and squeeze through. Alex, look. 
It's a conch stocking. What's that? Wrap Christmas party game includes novelty gifts, hats, and a forfeit game. That sounds fun. Babe. So you can get penguin one instead. Maybe we need to get me a gonk stocking for next year. We'll see. Next year though. Yeah, we'll see. It's gonks. You can't disc gonks. <gasps> Crackers. Oh, they look cool, look. Babe, we could get this for when we go to Kent. Santa's yes or no, game crackers. It's a fun festive where you can't answer yes or no. Yeah. <laughs> Should we get one for... Because these dogs treat oh, like that. What is it? 100% natural chicken. And Section of dog stuff and there's some really cute bits as well. Should we get a little something for the puppy? Oh, oh my God. Let's put these on, Dave. No, I don't like stuff like that on dogs. I think it's cruel. I don't like it. They're not made to be dressed up. No, I'm not. You sure? I'll squeeze it, squeeze it. No, it's not <laughs> happening. So, can you hold my nativity scene a second? Just so I don't drop it. <laughs> <laughs> so, we've got this. I think this is cute. Should we just get him this? Or should we get, what can we get to puppy? Christmas tree you want in our house. Tiny. No, <laughs> Scrooge. Look at the wreath, so really cute. We're still in the domestic about him getting me this, but what have you found? What is that? Barbecue Bible. Twenty-five quid, babe. <laughs> oh look! See, I love books and Christmas. I just feel like that would put me more in the festive spirit. And it's only 2 99 which I think is quite a good bargain. So... How can you have a whole book of vinegar? A race against the clock. <laughs> I would actually win that. It's one pound off. How much would you be could you costing me? 6 99 And it's got your little pencils that look like candy canes. You'd actually have a timer. I will, I will destroy that. <laughs> oh, God. <gasps> There's Paddington. Oh. Yeah, we couldn't even contact you. For... <laughs> oh, I found more gadgety bits. Right, you look away. Do not look. Okay. Do not look. Why? Oh, okay. He's a cute. I'm trying to find something for my grandma for Christmas and I'm really struggling. Oh. These bags are nice. That's really cute. Yeah. Right. So I've come over to show him something really cute. If it's going to focus. And he is playing. Oh. <laughs> That's, um... Oh, th this, is the, this is the section that I love that Matt would never come anywhere near. Matt. Babe. Found something you can get me for my stocking. Back scratcher. Put one on each arm. Oh no. Yeah, babe, I found some really like. <laughs> there you go. Oh. Actually, look. Like... <laughs> a bit of peaky blinder. So cute are these. I just this is just what I needed. That probably shouldn't make me as excited as it does. Oh, so cute. Little polar bears. This garden centre is amazing. I came here with Becca last year. But it's amazing. Fresh avocado. 
Why do I want this? Because it's you, and I've learnt more about you in the last... Oh, I needed a new fruit club. For that price, I'm alright. Yeah. I think we need to pay, don't we, first? No. Oh, looks so good. Oh, that is really nice. Yeah, that's not really nice, <laughs> but I've ordered it. Thank you. Oh, that looks really good too. Mm. I've had debates about me being able to try some of yours. Because I don't like what you've got, so you can't have any of what I have. Yeah, but that's just... <laughs> so if I've created a barrier... <laughs> oh, cake test. That's huh? That's oh my god. That's very nice. The only thing is very um. Only be cotton and cooled off. Yeah, because of snow. A Premier League game. Snow. That's just because Tottenham didn't want to lose again. Yeah. Yum. Oh, I'm gonna spill that. Oh. Look at that. Oh. Thank you. Happy? <laughs> now that's really close to me, Fiverr. <laughs> I have Nick some of that, so for him giving it all that go, I'm not having any. I didn't have a choice. It's not focusing on your face. There you go. Nice. A very kind offer. And go. <laughs> I'm joking. Alright, I need to get some pictures. I don't want any of your food. So deep because I definitely do. Okay. Well we know that. Alex is just like, have I dropped anything yet? Mmm. That's a very good. What on earth are you doing? Making it more chocolatey. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, so please. Right, so just for any clarification, maybe I'm going crazy. So Josh is dipping his millionaire shortbread in his hot chocolate. I know you can get millionaire hot chocolate, hot chocolate as well, or something infused in Starbucks or somewhere. Chocolate somewhere. Yeah, shortbread, huh? I um, really bad oh. I swear I'm <laughs> The past life, Alex, your spiritual life. Wait, you, you can't jump. No, no, I had a dream about that. That's really good. Oh, shall we tell you ready? Right, what's the matter? Oh, this lighting is just oh every time I come to a garden centre, I just think I need to be banned from spending money for the next oh. six. I think that's great. That smell is disgusting. <laughs> Smells in your ass. <laughs> Deck the halls with boughs of holly and around. Reason why I love Josh's car? Christmas tunes. <laughs> Name your favourite Christmas song in the comments. So, Matt's just dropping me off. And after a really festive day, it's kind of snowing. Sleep, yeah. There was a bit of snow before the sleep. <laughs> There was. So, how much more festive could you want to get? Now, it is 10 to 6. I'm going to get in. I'm going to decorate my room with the bits that are already out and with some of the bits that I got today because I will show you guys what I got. And then I'm going to film a gift guide for him. So, because I'm feeling really in the festive spirit and I want to film some Christmassy videos. So, I may put a Christmas decoration up on my bedside cabinet to make it look a bit more festive. I know. But Matt got a very good picture of me, though. Can I just... I'll give him that. There were these really cute arches, and I'm sorry. I don't know if it's Not gonna. Focus. Oh, there you go. There you go. Kind of get the gist. I got some pictures with well, a picture with Josh on this. They were like, how much were these? Seven hundred pounds. Seven hundred pounds. Seven hundred pounds for these stone hand chairs, obviously for outside. Um. And I got some pictures with my bestie too. And she, we've now changed my my home screen to be a bit more festive. Let me know your favourite Christmas songs in the comments because I'm really interested. But my giveaway video has gone live. People have been commenting and entering. And I've got to say, I've already found one of my favourite comments. Obviously, I'm giving it time. Um, but yeah. It's very, very exciting. Um, 
So make sure you've been entering that. Um, and I'm going to do some editing tonight and watch some. I'm actually going to maybe start a new series. Normal people. It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. now home i'm about to have some soup and then i will show you guys what i picked up so i'm gonna have a cream of tomato because one of my favorite soups especially at this time of year um, and it's full-on snowing outside as you would have seen the clip they can go up there i'll be preparing my snacks for work in a bit um so yeah got them and then i'm gonna have some pringles I could not be happy honestly like we've just had I've had some great news today and I just feel very happy mum's topped up the crisps selection so I've got plenty of crisps um but yeah this will be where so this will be where obviously most of my Christmas decorations will be um but Matt will be taking off that shelf so that can go along there and probably measuring up whilst he's here as well um so yeah but i've got some vimto candy floss for my bestie as well um but i'll be organizing all the stuff um i won't be i can show you matt's stuff but i won't be showing you alex's because there's a high chance she'll be watching this vlog um and you know i'll show you a bit nearer to the time or when she's got them um so yeah but my having hands will probably have to go down on a lower level or stand like maybe along the bottom um but yeah these are my two books so currently <laughs> i haven't read this one yet they're my cornwall cornwall books um but i'm very excited to show you the bits i picked up this will be going i'm gonna get matt to take it um so he can take it to the lock up and then i'm gonna potentially gonna try and sell it but yeah so this will be all festive and then when it's not festive it'll be tastefully decorated with cute little so bits and pieces. i've got my dinner tomato soup got Grey's Anatomy on um, and then I'm going to export footage from my camera to my iPad and then I'm going to film two hauls. I'm going to film um, a super drug haul. Um, well no I'm not going to film a super drug haul. I'm just going to show you the bits like a few bits that I got today. Um, and then I'm going to film a gift guide for him because there are so many bits and pieces that I've got today that I just, I think could be really helpful to you guys if you're shopping on a budget or, you know, just some good ideas that you may want to pick up for someone that would like the kind of stuff I got. So I have not filmed any of the content that I wanted to. I'm currently lying sideways in bed. Um, my room is a tip and I do need to tidy that before I do go to sleep, I've got to be honest, but... I'm on episode two, series one of Normal People, and can I just say it is just the idea, like the idea behind it, and in my opinion, so far, and I'm only a second episode deep in it, but I really like it. I think it's really good. Um, but my anxiety flared up really badly earlier, um, so I haven't been able to film anything, and this is the reality of my life at the moment. And tomorrow is a new day. And hopefully in the evening I'll have the energy and the mental capability of doing it because I want to show you guys what I got from the garden centre. I want to show you guys and I want to film a Christmas super drug haul. Um, I popped a spot and it is really painful. Um, and I'm going to try and film tomorrow night. So yeah, that is the plan. Um, so I'll see you guys tomorrow. Hi guys, so fast forward to wednesday because when i was last filming this vlog it was sunday and i've already started my second festive vlog it's wednesday the first of december now but of course i couldn't end this festive vlog though without showing you the bits i picked up when i was with matt josh and alex um when i was with josh and matt and my bestie so i'm gonna show you the bits that i picked up and matt also got me our yearly tradition now we're doing is he gets me a um new christmas decoration which i just think is so cute um but the first thing i got in here is the cupid and comet festive dog trees um because matt's family are getting a puppy and i cannot be i just i'm just so excited i just cannot i just cannot and his other dog who is obviously the heart and soul of the fam um i have got a gift for already 
um so thought it was only fair and how cute is this it's a stocking um and me and matt may make a last minute dash to this garden center because they have got some other treats which we think his first dog um you know first born dog um would love so but this has got uh, three treats in and two toys so you've got salmon bites turkey bites and cheese biscuits if she is um if their puppy is not able to eat any of this then we can give it to the other dog but the the toys will be for the puppy for sure is you get a little cracker and a tennis ball and this was around 7.95 which i think is really reasonable this garden center shocked us with the prices as you would have seen from some much reactions priceless um but yeah so i just think super cute and really actually cost effective if you want to see the brand that's what it's called but yeah i thought how cute is that um and then the rest of it oh no i've got that got me something but i'm gonna show you guys this this is a advent ca uh, calendar which i think i showed already in this vlog um and it's actually got matt's name on so he knows about it but he'll probably forget because he forgets everything um so got him that um, it's got like funny things for each month i also got matt some golf lint lint golf balls how just like because matt loves golf if you didn't know um i got myself a gonk cereal bowl now i'm currently looking at the cutest gonk ever i've got another gonk down here and i'm just gonk obsessed i'm really tempted to order gonk christmas bedding um yeah sorry about the not my bed you know i'm just being realistic um i'm tempted to order gonk begging gonks are my thing gonks are my addiction at christmas time they are just so cute um go on from the pound shop for i believe three pounds bargain um so yeah honestly just love gongs they didn't have a gonk mug i have got a gonk christmas mug already that's from last year um oh i think i may have chipped the bowl oh, but this is the bowl and i just envisaged myself having the cutest morning in the mornings crisp cold mornings you know as they are at the moment nice cup of tea in the gonk mug with the gonk cereal bowl just humor me okay 4.99 bargain um i then got myself to feel extra festive especially when i'm staying at my grandma's you know things cross touch wood everything praying um this is just a book called the christmas wish and this is by tilly tennant and it is two for five pounds or 2.99 so i don't i just got this one which is 2.99 which i thought was amazing because it retails for 7.99 um and the cover is just really cute you know it's all about the cover and the blurb said christmas is coming but it doesn't feel that way for esme due to buy her cheating fiance warren and mourning the death of her beloved grandmother she's determined not to li let life beat her and books a trip to lapland on a holiday that her grandmother has always dreamed of taking beneath the indigo skies of lapland love is in the last thing on esme's mind but she can't ignore a spark for sack a broodingly handsome actor also nursing a broken heart when esme is bombarded by messages from warren promising he's changed and discovered that zack is hiding something will her head be turned then a trip to the northern lights reveals the full extent of zack's own secret past is there any hope that esme will get the happy ending that her grandmother wished for her so much my cup of tea a book like honestly this book is me just not my life obviously but this book is just my kind of book to read and the fact that it's christmas based as well like hello had to be done and then drum roll please i need to buy some cheap tea lights because there's gonna be some great scenes here but this was 9.99 and it's the most beautiful it's just amazing so it is a nativity scene nativity scene tea light holder like my bestie pro proved to me that it was a tea light holder so i was thinking oh my god that's so cute she's like you put a tea light in the back of it i was like oh thank you so obviously it glows through the stars and it's just gonna be beautiful not sure where it's going yet i'm thinking over here by my lamp but i'm not 100 percent sure so probably on my marble tray thing on my chest of drawers when i've got the tea light in it because that's where i normally put my candles um but i've got my fir tree candles on top of my mrs hinch books and i've got my mauled wine candle which smells bloody amazing on my chest of drawers currently um so yeah i was really happy with that i just thought it was really cute and he knew i really 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 wanted it and he said well let's kick start off our tradition with that so yeah very happy um you know what i'm just gonna put it there now 
I just stand. Um, but in my next festive vlog, there is so much to look forward to. Um, honestly, I can't even express. Obviously, there's Advent, decorating for Christmas. You know, I'm just, I'm just saying, it's going to be a good one. So. Thank you so much for all the love and support on my videos recently. Thank you for getting me to 1,900 subscribers. We're already at nearly 1,920, which is just craziness to me. The giveaway is still live and will be live till the 11th, I think, or 12th of December, around then. So you've still got plenty of time. Hopefully by the time I post this, I wanna be consistent with my uploads through the festive month. Um, and I hope you're all doing amazing. Let me know how you're doing in the comments. Let me know what you've done so far. Um, in December in the comments um, and I will see you in my next vlog or video which you watch first make sure you subscribe make sure you smash the big thumbs up and I'll see you in my next one bye